Hey guys, this is Roz. I've been tagged by RDP Project, Rob. Hello Rob, how you doing? Thanks again for tagging me. Um, he showed his work EDC. He's some kind of a security guy and he wears a cool bat belt with a gun and a knife and flashlight and extra batteries and all that. But I'm a woman that works in an office uh, in front of a computer. So this is how exciting my video is gonna be. But maybe I can make it a little exciting. And literally, literally I am running out the door to go to work. So I gotta hopefully get this in one take. Okay, I do not leave my house, work or anywhere, weekend, pick it up, anywhere I go, I do not forget my water bottle. This is a Hydro Flask, and this is a double walled stainless steel bottle, and whatever temperature you put in there is gonna stay the exact same temperature for like a day. So if I put ice cold water in there in the morning, it's gonna stay cold all day long. If you put hot coffee in there, it's gonna stay that exact temperature all day long. Well, maybe not exact, but you know what I'm saying. It's, this is a really well-built thing. I got one little dent in it. The first day I had it, I dropped it. But sometimes you need that first thing to really you know, bond with something. So anyway, this is my Hydro Flask water bottle. Um, it's like 34 ounces, I think. And it goes with me every day. I'll even turn around and go home and grab it back out of the fridge if I forgot it. Um, I guess we'll just stay on the food food and drink. Um, today I'm going to have this for lunch, a Star Kiss tuna. You know, I think it has some mayo in it. This is actually my daughter's. I'm stealing it out of her cupboard. But uh, it's 100 calories. It's got 13 grams of protein. And I don't also don't leave the house without my little trail mix that I like to make. This is raw almonds, dried cranberries, sunflower seeds. I throw a couple of chocolate chips in there and some medjool dates. Is that how you pronounce it? M-E-D-J-O-O-L, medjool dates. So this is um, a, a whole food snack that I like to snack on, or I may even sometimes have it for lunch. But I'll just keep adding to it. Like I filled it fresh today, but I'll tonight put some more in for tomorrow, that kind of thing. So I, I always like to have some kind of whole food snacks around, and I'm bringing a banana too. So, so wow, hey, okay, the lady that works at the computer. <laughs> this is hilarious. Um, all right, this is, uh, I have two chrome bags to show you. Chrome. Uh, I'm, I kind of, they have a weird website. Is it chromebagsstore.com or chromebagssf for sanfrancisco.com, something like that. They make bike messenger bags, but they also make um, another line of products, you know, maybe not necessarily for, you know, maybe for people like me. Okay, let's just say that. This is their hip bone, H-I-P bone. This is discontinued. They do make a hip bone now, but it's more like a fanny pouch that connects to your belt. I saw a review of this hip bone on YouTube a couple, two years ago maybe, by Video Scenario. He's, he's a really unique dude here. He, closed, he, he closes accounts and opens accounts and other names and all. He's, he's really interesting, but he had this bag, and he was rocking it, and I searched high and low on the internet, and I finally, I forget where I, I think he steered me where to buy it. Um, anyway, so I have it. I have it, and I've had it for a while. It is a really interesting, do you see how this bag is, is just, it's cut different, and it actually doesn't hold all that much. It wasn't built to hold all that much, um, but it, it does find its way into my rotation. Um, it's got a sleeve back here, which is really hard to get anything into, but it does have a sleeve. If your bag was less packed, you'd be able to access it better. It's got these cool, like, stainless steel clips back here on each side. This, let me get this out of the way. This, this is not discontinued. Chrome sells this now. This is... Uh, too, it's too expensive, but uh, it's a keychain holder. And this half hooks on your bag with a snap and is removable. But I just love Chrome's little um, seat belt clips. Super cool. So I hook that on, go shopping, and then when I get back to, to my car, I just very readily, one finger, release my keys. And on my keys, I have a Maritech. Um, is it AAA in there or AA, guys? I forget. Looks like it might be. Oh, let me just tell you. It is AAA. I use this every day. Okay, so that's my uh, AAA Maritech flashlight from Countycom. Got my keys, keys. I, I wrapped them up, whatever, you know. You know why. Okay, and I have a little, uh, what is that? Spiderco bug. Super duper. I like my little stainless steel stuff here, especially with my chrome, chrome gear here. All right, so let's get back to this Chrome hip bone. Chrome, some of their products have the cool seat belt buckle. Not all of them, and, and I almost wish more of them did have the cool buckle. 
their straps are made of seat belt webbing material. How cool is that? I mean, it feels good. It feels good on your shoulder. You know, you don't need padding because it's so thick and soft. All right, so let's get on in, in here with Roz's EDC. Let's get this over with. This is my ID. I keep that just, you know, the ID is obviously not an holder. Um, I have a, a Maxpedition wallet. I actually went back and bought a black one so that it would match my Chrome bags. Um, I think they call it the micro wallet. Um, here I have a Statler mechanical pencil, really nice knurled. Um, I don't know what material it's made of. It, it looks like stainless steel, but it's not. But um, if you have kids and they always have to do homework with pencils, this is an excellent type of mechanical pencil to carry in your bag. It's not going to break like a number two pencil, you know what I mean? A lead pencil to carry. That. And over here I carry a couple of Parker, oh no, that's not a Parker, this is a Parker Jotter, and I keep a Parker Gel refill in there. I'm really, I really like my pens, guys. This is a Zebra 701, and also to go with the stainless steel, I have, that's where I hide my knife. This is a San Ren Mew, I think it's a 710, right? I got this from Keterbug15 from YouTube. She was having a fundraiser, raising money for um, uh, lymphoma. And uh, anyway, so I donated to her, and she gave me the knife. It's, it's, you know, I know it's one of these cheap knives, but boy, it's nice. It feels good. <laughs> it's got a nice lock. Uh, anyway, and it looks nice in here, and the clip is perfect because uh, it just slides really nice there. I cover it up here. It's just kind of incognito, you know. It just looks like one of the other pencils I have in here. It has this uh, rubbery material here, which is which is really kind of cool, and and like a waterproof zipper here with a pocket. My iPhone 3GS, so it has a video, but it doesn't have Siri. iPhone 4 would have the Siri, but this case is from um, Columbia River Knife and Tool CRKT. They call it the Inox 45, I N O X. Um, slides in like that. See. This is sharp, and I'm telling you, I get a lot of comments. I pull my phone out, people are like, whoa, hey, like they all want to know about it. You know what's interesting? Women want to know about it. I don't think I've ever pulled this out in front of a, a woman that didn't ask me about it. Men, men may stare, but women actually ask me about it. But you can access your volume controls real easily right here, and your, your mute button there, home button's right in the front there. Uh, yeah, I'm late. <laughs> Now I have to use, oh gosh, okay, I'm late for work, people. Um, power button here, your earbud cord, you can plug in there. And you can charge it also without removing it from the case, see? All right, so that's uh, that's my iPhone. Oh, I gotta, I gotta get speeded up. I got a moleskin Kahir, which I write notes in all day long. Don't, don't. I'm addicted to this gum. Addicted to that gum. Because there's something I want to show you. Tissues, I always have tissues. Um, this is a Max Edition, um, is this the Urban Wallet? So, yeah, so this thing would be those other cards like Costco or your health cards or something like that. Um, but what I'm getting at down here, guys, is um, this, this little pouch in here. This is made by Chrome. This is their accessory pouch, and I keep my Nightcore D10 in there, and um, this little thing would change. But what's cool about it is this can attach to the strap of your messenger bag, so you can have your, your phone accessible right there or your radio or something. It's got a little port in the top, maybe for head. You maybe you can put your iPhone in there and your earbuds poking out of there. Um, but the knife I carry in here is, was a gift to me by Mr. Jimbo Fox. This is a um, CRKT Drifter with D10 handles. Beautiful, beautiful. Thank you, Jimbo. But the other bag I use is a Chrome Vega, V-E-G-A. And it's... Um, it's a nice big bag. It's got a big pouch in the back. Also, the seatbelt strap. Uh, it doesn't have the cool seatbelt um, buckles, but it has these side release buckles. It also has Velcro. Um, like most of my bags, I have what I call neutralized. Neutralize my Velcro. I put a little piece there so it's not like <laughs> rip every time. Um, so there's a pouch here. Of course, I have more gum, pen, a highlighter here. Um, this is another moleskin. Um, Kahir notebook. It's got a zipper here and a big, big pouch or sleeve there. And then in here is where I keep all my stuff. Mango avocado salad. Oh, you can't see that. Yeah, I'm working on some recipes. Some, some new. Got to freshen it up. 
Got some Appalachian Trail magazines and some stuff. But what's really cool about the chrome bags is the inside is sort of this rubbery material. And there's one kid on YouTube, he made a pretty um, artistic video about his chrome bag. But he was riding his bike around campus and picking up his mail and all this stuff. Um, but at one point, he empties his messenger bag and he fills it with ice and beer. And he gets on his bike and he goes and beats his friends. So yes, you can use this as a cooler. <laughs> It's totally rubberized. That's hilarious. So that's the Chrome Vega. So I use that for work to carry um, work folders back and forth and notes and things I need for that. And I'm going to pack it all up now and I have to leave. Oh, this is the Max Ocean Volta. I use this to carry meds. Like I got Advil in there and kind of just some, some little junky junk stuff. Okay, so I got to go. Um, Rob, thanks for tagging me. And I will see everybody on another day. Thanks again. Thanks for tuning in. Bye.